It's been a blast, man. Keep in touch, all right? Definitely. Even even when you're overseas, okay? I bet I will. Thanks, man. Congratulations. Be Thanks. safe. Oh yeah, I heard him. But I think Carl, you turned the. Uh, I think you turned the wrong way. That vlog with Carl from North Carolina picking up that beautiful Long Beach red car is coming up soon on our channel. It's Tuesday. It's time now for a quick tip from Rick. But before we get into that, let's go inside and let's talk about my channel analytics and the demographic of the audience. Now, I made a quick reference on Sunday and some of the people, I don't know if I struck a chord or what, but everyone's like defending themselves. Hey, hey, uh, 36 here, Rick. Uh, don't forget me. I'm 37 right here. I just was, <laughs> I was just letting you know the adults that watch this channel the, the the core is that 45 to 65 and you're gonna see the breakdown of the people that are watching our channel that uh, understand relate and share the passion the joy and the love for Corvette but uh, truth be told I've been shocked that I've had uh, some people watch it right now and I know some of the guys are I got a nice young guy uh, in his early and mid 20s that have bought new Corvettes uh, early mid 30s have bought new Corvettes congratulations good for you don't wait until is <laughs> someday over the rainbow, if you will. Uh, yeah, everybody's mindset over the years are changing, and part of that is inbred to our younger audience of the 20s, 30s, and 40s because of what your parents and your grandparents went through. You're like, ah, you know what? I don't want to wait till I'm 65 to get my Corvette. I want to get it now. I want to get it before I have kids. I mean, there's a lot of different things, but I've seen that mindset change over the years that I've been selling this car, so it's neat. So I wasn't ignoring you guys in the 30s and the 20s and the 40s. I just... <laughs> And so it's kind of funny. Everyone's kind of standing up for themselves. Hey, <laughs> all right, good. So after we go over the demographics, our quick tip today is going to be kind of a continuation of last week, if you will. I appreciate you taking the time to watch the channel. I know a lot of folks look forward to these little tips. And if they help at least one person in the audience, it's mission accomplished for Corvette ownership. But also on today's vlog, I'm, uh, I'm going to make an announcement about a giveaway we're going to have for you on Friday. I think you're going to enjoy this one. All right, guys, we've not done this in a while. Let me show you the age demographics of the people that are watching the channel right now. All right, guys, I'll try not to get my fingers in the way, but this is truly a snapshot from YouTube of the audience that watched our channel throughout the entire year of 2019. And this is nothing more than statistical data that sometimes is interesting. So you see this bracket here, 13 to 17 years old, 0.1%. Uh, this has got to be my son, Ryan. He's 17, so that's him. <laughs> the 18 to 24 category is 5.1%, 25 to 34 is 12.7%, 35 to 44 is 16.5, and this is this is what I was referring to in the Sunday Coffee with Conti. The core is that 45 to 65. You can see right here that 22.7 is your 45 to 54 right there. The 55 to 64 is 23%. So these two brackets right here, and even really getting into the 65 plus 19.9%. So that is our core audience, not discarding you guys in your 30s. I saw you putting your hand in the air like we talked about earlier. Hey, I'm 36. I watch. Hey, I'm 33. I bought a car from you. <laughs> but this was some data from once in a while. It's kind of interesting to share with you guys that besides yourself, who else is watching the channel? Alright guys, welcome to Tuesday and a quick tip from Rick. Last week we talked about how to get back in here. It's brain damage, pulling this apart to jump your battery in the event that the battery was dead. But I told you guys, get that $100 battery protection option if you didn't have it. And I apologize, I didn't put the part number up on the screen, so there it is for you, right? There, okay, there it is. And take that part number into your Chevy parts counter and order the battery protection option. Remember, I told you guys, you could probably go a longer duration, but it, to me, just so mentally, you know that the car's protected. If it's going to sit where it's not going to be driven, it's not going to be started for at least two weeks, you want to plug in the battery protection package. And you just need a regular 110 outlet, and you can leave it plugged in all winter long for your off-season, per se, if you're a client that's watching and you're in the off-season area, all right? Like Ohio, Michigan, Indiana, Maryland. Okay, you get it. <laughs> now, you may have noticed in the back of many new Corvettes, there's a white box. Well, this is what's inside that white box. This is your battery protection option. As we told you last week, remember this port right here in the back on the passenger side always stays hot. So flip that up. Just kind of looks like a little cigarette lighter port. You take the end right here, plug it straight in. 
Now what's nice, the skinnier cord can actually lie right here and actually have the hatch closed down, but what I recommend is putting a little towel here over your rear spoiler of the vehicle. See, now it's protected there, and you're able to close down your hatch. Skinny cord comes down here into the unit itself, then the cord's a little thicker right here that actually plugs into the wall. If you find the other end right there she is, hang on. Yeah, let me turn the camera light off here for a second. All right, I think that's a little bit better for you guys. Okay, you can see the three indicator lights across the top there. The one on the far left, you don't want that ever lit up. That's letting you know that the battery cables are reversed. Uh, red is not where it's supposed to be, black's not where it's supposed to be, but the middle one is letting you know that the system right now is currently charging the battery as it's plugged in, as you can see right over there, and it's plugged into the car right now. And the one on the far right will let you know that when it's lit up that the battery is fully charged, but you can still leave this plugged in. And then the green light down there, you can see, the picture of the car is just letting you know that the system is on and it is working. So that is your battery protection package. Again, the part number is up on the screen if you don't have one of these. And your car is going to sit for any length of time with all the electronics in these cars. You guys, this is the best investment you can ever make to protect your Corvette. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed today's quick tip. I know sometimes it's, you know, it's the little things, and boy, they really do add up, don't they? It's kind of nice to have a refresher every once in a while. Now, coming up on Friday, it's a vlog I've been wanting to do. It also was requested from William in Michigan. Kind of let you guys know, kind of like what we did with the demographics. I love all that nutty little stuff, but you like to know what people are ordering on the 2020 C8 Corvette. Some of the orders I have in so far from last year, what is in the order bank? What are people picking color and option-wise? Well, that's what we're going to do. We're going to flash back to 2019 and talk about the 2020 C8 pre-orders. We're going to have a pop quiz and a prize, and you're going to have an opportunity to win what's in this little bag right here. Thanks to our viewer and our customer that has a C8 on order, Steve Roberson in Iowa. I'll show you what's in here. Some of you guys already know what this is. We talked about it earlier on the blog. I have all 12 colors in the coins for the C8 2020 Corvette. You guys are going to have an opportunity to win this, and I told you I'm going to make you. I'm going to make you earn it. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. So join us Friday. Make sure you're a subscriber to the channel so you're eligible to win. That's absolutely free. We talked about that too. So click the bell notification. Flashback Friday coming up, talking about what everybody has got ordered so far for the 2020 C8 Corvette, and then a quiz so you have an opportunity to win all of these cool collector coins for the C8 car. Thanks for watching today, and before we go, yes, before we go, it's time now to showcase and share some of your beautiful rides. Let's get my hand, let's do this. Let's do this. Bam! See you Friday.
in Oh, and your heart's bleeding And all you can see is red Till you discover It is within each other To forgive and make amends If I am no man Or what I know now I wouldn't have said what I said I took the long road Thought I'd be better on my own Sometimes what's right is wrong instead Cause I was too young And I didn't understand that you And I didn't understand that you were the one